And shifting focus to continuous coverage of the Israel-Hamas war and battleground Gaza. The tensions are heating up on other fronts. Israel has indicated a shift to a less intense phase of war in Gaza. The RDF has confirmed that its forces will carry more targeted operations focusing in central and southern Gaza Strip. Israeli army says its forces have uncovered Hamas's largest weapons production site so far in Gaza. The RDF says that the factory has been discovered in Burej, a densely populated civilian area in central Gaza. It also claims that it discovered underground workshops which were allegedly used to manufacture long-range missiles capable of hitting targets in northern Israel. The RDF also released a video showing ongoing combat in Gaza and the alleged discovery of weapons in Khan Yunus. And as the operations move to center and the south, Israel says that there are still terrorist operatives and weapons in northern Gaza, but they do not function within an organized military framework. The RAF says it is operating in a different way in that region. Meanwhile, Gaza continues to suffer massive destruction. There are drone footages of the territory showing the extent of damage. There are countless buildings that have been turned into rubble. Gaza's health ministry says that on Monday, 249 Palestinians were killed and around 500 were wounded across the territory in the last 24 hours. On the other hand, months into the war, Hamas is still able to fire a barrage of rockets towards Israel. A red alert warning was sounded in southern Israel on Monday and explosions were also heard. Meanwhile, Palestinian militant group Islamic Jihad has released yet another video of a hostage held in Gaza pleading for release. The video shows 47-year-old Israeli hostage Elad Katsir, who could be heard saying that he had been close to dying. Hamas and its allied group PIJ have released such videos multiple times of the hostages. Over 100 hostages are still held in Gaza who were kidnapped during the deadly October 7th attack on Israel.